Hello friends. I'm back with another interview question, which is what is the difference between static and singleton class? Let's get started. Many developers have used singleton pattern because it's the easiest pattern to implement and learn. As the name suggests, singleton means that one class, which can be utilized throughout the life cycle of the application. Now the question is, we can create a class is static and the object of that static class is available throughout the life cycle of the application. So if we have already have the static class where we can get a single object. Why should I go for the hassle of creating this whole singleton class? A singleton can implement interfaces, inherit from other classes and allow inheritance. While a static class cannot inherit their instance members. That's why singleton is more flexible than static classes. Static is a keyword but singleton is a design pattern. In singleton, we have control over the object creation of the class but, we have no control on the static class object creation. Static class objects cannot be passed as parameters to other methods whereas we can pass instances of a singleton as a parameter to another method. We can clone the singleton class object whereas it is not possible to clone a static class. It is possible to dispose the objects of a singleton class whereas it is not possible to dispose of a static class. Singleton object stored in heap while static class stored in stack. When the compiler compiles the static class then internally it treats the static class as an abstract and sealed class. This is the reason why neither we create an instance nor extend a static class in C-sharp. The singleton class constructor is always marked as private. This is the reason why we cannot create an instance from outside the singleton class. It provides either public static property or a public static method whose job is to create the singleton instance only once and then return that singleton instance each and every time when we call that public static property or method from outside the singleton class. We generally use static class for writing utilities or extension methods. For example, we have a string class and we want to add an extension method to that string class then we will write a static extension method. We can write some utilities like currency conversion, string formatting, data table to list, etc. Then, we will use static classes. Singleton classes are primarily used for creating connection objects, creating logs, caching, managing database connections, managing service proxies etc. This was the answer to the popular interview question, what is the difference between a static class and a singleton class? I hope you like this video and if you want to watch more such videos then please subscribe to my channel and if you like this video, do hit that like button. Thank you for watching and stay connected for more videos.